And now, the continuation of Hell's Kitchen. Piss off. Jesus. Barbie thinks that she can throw Kimmy and myself underneath the bus and fresh Chef Ramsay. There's definitely gonna be hell to pay. This is war. Bring your A game. I'm bringing mine. We got one person breaking this team down. One person is not gonna change. It's bringing us all down. It's making us all look bad. Listen, this is the thing. You give somebody enough rope, they'll hang themselves. But she's hanging all of us. Barbie sabotaged your team tonight. One individual made eight other people fail. That's a problem. The pressure is really getting to Robin. She's really starting to crack. Cream rises to the top, babe. Yeah, you know what? I'll be fucking rising to the top, and you're going to be going fucking home. I'm not going home tonight. With no end in sight for the tension between Barbie and the rest of the women, it seems the only time the red team is not fighting is when they're sleeping. And as a new day begins, Barbie decides she shouldn't be the only one up early cleaning. What the fuck is that? Wake up. I don't even make that much noise when I walk. I just want everybody to remember where they are and what we're here to do. Really? What are you doing? Really? I just washed the dishes. I, I came out here with you going like this, and you and dumb and bitch. I, listen, somebody needs to tell the fucking bitch what's up. You're about to get choked out. Knock it off. Grow up. You're 33. I'm not about to get choked. Yeah. No, I'm not about to get choked out. I'm not about to get choked, choked out. You dumb and cunt. Yeah, cunt. I'm shaking in my boots. Shake it. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I know you're this close to snapping, Robin. I don't give a fuck, bitch. Yeah, I know you don't. I, don't give I know you don't. Think about everything. It's Chef here. I'd like to see everybody with their jackets on urgently. Yes, Chef. Everybody downstairs now. At this point, the team does not need any more fighting. Like, we need to come together as a team or we're going to lose a challenge and be stuck doing some crazy ass shit. Move. Fast, faster, guys, faster. Go, come on. Pick it up. Pick it up. Hurry up, come on. Quietly, OK? Let's go, come on, come on. All of a sudden, we look, and the dining room is full. There's American flags everywhere. America the Beautiful is playing. And there's this judge singing. Where are we right now? Congratulations on becoming citizens of the United States of America. That's awesome. It's a very special day. I became American four months ago, and I know how hard it is to get a citizenship in this country. I applied twice. Ladies and gentlemen, congratulations. In honor of all of you becoming citizens, we will be serving you an all-American meal. Everybody. Right, chefs, first team to complete serving their side of the dining room wins the challenge. Are you ready? Yes, chef. Yeah. Stations, let's go. For today's challenge, each kitchen must cook an all-American meal for 60 new citizens. Congratulations. The menu consists of a California Cobb salad appetizer, followed by a choice of three entrees, Nebraska beef sliders, a thin New York-style pizza, and a Wisconsin grilled cheese sandwich. Today, in a true test of speed and synchronization, the team that finishes serving their side of the dining room first wins the challenge. Guys, we can't rush. We have to get it out right. OK, here we go. Red team, first ticket in. Yeah, a special lunch for a very special occasion. On order, table 31, two cob salad, three slider, two pizza, one grilled cheese. Cob salad out first, then the entrees. Yes, chef. Come on, guys, come on. We got it, we got it. Who's on the cob salad? Who's on the cob salad? Me, chef. Let's go then, come on. That lettuce coming. Just remember, we got to get that cob salad out first. Who's got tomatoes? Right here, already cut. Guys, come on, cut those eggs. Let's go. The blue team is eager to fire their entrees. Pay attention to what we're doing. But must wait until Royce has completed the salads. Meanwhile, in the red kitchen, Barbie Garnishing pizzas. waits for no one. What's that for? Barbie, where's that going? 
Why are we firing the pizza when they serve the cop salad? I made a mistake, Chef. Barbie, I cooked the pizzas. Why are you making the pizza already? I ain't even got the cob salad yet. Communicate with me. Yo, where's the salad? How many fries? We need any fries? I can't hear you. Real quick, listen. All the cob salads need to go out before we can even start the entrees. Let's go. Thank you, Robin. I'm gonna sit here and cut your tomatoes. Someone needed to step up. This is my chance to prove myself. It proves it, Chef Ramsay, that I have what it takes to be here. Ladies, we got this, all right? Come on, I'm gonna run it. Man, I felt like I had a rocket up my ass. This is how fast I was moving in that kitchen. Behind, Chef. Very nice. Service, please. Salads are out, ladies. Salads are out. Mm, this is good. Thanks to Robin, the women are moving on to their first entrees. But over on the blue side, nothing has left the kitchen. And it's all thanks to the man on salads. Royce! Yes, Chef? Where's your cob salad? One minute, Chef! Come on, Royce, pick it up, buddy. Let's get one out. And Royce is capable of doing this. Royce is going to perform like a motherfucker. Royce is getting fired up. First one, look. Unbelievable. Hey, all of you, come here, Muppets. Royce decided to put mushrooms on a Californian cob salad. Fuck me. Royce is just a fucking idiot. It's mind-boggling. You're back there on salads. All you're doing is assembling something on a plate where 50% is already done for you, and you can't get it right. I got a salad coming right now. Why are you helping me make a fucking salad? You didn't put out one. Come on, guys, please. It's a fucking salad. Give me a bowl. Give me a bowl. Salad's in the window. Let's go. Second salad going up. Chef behind. Service, please. Beautiful. Good job. With Guy and Clemenza coming to the rescue, salads are finally leaving the blue kitchen. Thank you. Keep pushing, keep pushing. Do not give up. Meanwhile, in the red kitchen... Sliders, walk into the window! The women are ready to send out their first table of entrees. All they need is... Pizza! Barbie, pizzas need a dress. Oh, my fucking god! You're killing me. Barbie, you're a stupid bitch. Get the fuck off my station. I don't need your help. Just garnish the fucking pizzas. Barbie, Barbie, I need, what are you doing? The danger station. OK, got it. She's moving around like a jumping jack, and she's cooking pizzas when she's not supposed to. Ladies, where is the fucking pizza? Pizza's here, chef. That looks like shit. Hey, all of you, come here. Welcome to America. Look at that. You eat that bit now. Hey, come here. You eat that as well. That's what you're serving them. Burnt, shitty, black pizza. I'd rather flee the fucking country. I'm so sick of this bitch. With Barbie the way that she is, I can't tell if she's sabotaging or if she's actually trying to help. Get off the pizzas. It's getting old, seriously. Barbie sucks. She pisses everybody off. She needs to go home. While Barbie has been deported from the pizza station. Building burgers? I can build burgers. In the blue kitchen. I got this in the fucking bag. Clemenza is ready to give these new citizens a little taste of his part of the world. You're good, Clemenza. I'm coming. Don't worry about the pizza, man. Dude, coming from New York, come on. I ate a lot of fucking pizza in my life. My family actually owned the pizzeria. It's right up my alley. Pizza up, chef. What is that? It's not even cooked. There we go. Clemenza, the pizza's not cooked enough. The New York style crisp pizza. I got it. You should be able to nail a New York style pizza. This is a joke. Get me another pizza going. What the fuck? Man? I don't know. It's fucking oven. How do you fuck up a pizza? They take two seconds to cook. Dump the thing on the ground and fire another one. Come on, Clemenzo. Come on, buddy. Come on. How long on the pizza? Coming up on the pizza soon. Make sure it's perfect, Clemenzo. While the men are stalled waiting on pizza. Bounce back. I know. The red team. Coming down the line. Rallies. And entrees continue to quickly make their way to the dining room. Pizzas walk in right now. Burgers walking now. We got you. We're walking to the window with you. Pizza time, babe. Now we're finally communicating. Hallelujah. Service, please. Sliders. This looks good. Typically American. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Another pizza up, chef. Service, please. Clemenza has recovered on the pizza station. Guys, what about the sliders? And the men are now counting on Brian to deliver on his burgers. You got the slider up? It's coming right now, baby. It's go time. And I am going to be there for my team. This isn't easy. It's mini burgers. Oh, dear. Look at me, all of you. It's fucking raw. American citizenship, and we welcome them with that. This is embarrassing. They deserve better than that. Who did this? I did, Chef. 
Ryan, the ground beef is raw. It's raw. Can someone take fucking control? God damn it. A slider. I'm going to get on it, chef. I can't sink any further. A slider. Ryan, I'm going to help you right now. It's tough to watch grown-ass men setting up raw sliders. It's a little burger. Move, 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 move. I'm dying for the sliders. I'm ready on the sliders. Three sliders walking. Patrick. Yes, chef. The nicely cooked. Thank you, chef. Go, please. Guys, let's go. Keep working. Focus. While the blue team hustles to make up for lost time, the red team... You got two tickets left. ...is making a dash to the finish line. Come on, ladies. We got it, guys. We got this. Real cheese needs to walk. Sliders, walk into the window. Service, please. Gentlemen, you got three tables left. Hurry up. First to finish. Let's go. Pick it up. Ladies, last table. Come on. We got this. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Pizza! Five seconds, chef. Oh, we're waiting for one pizza. My hands are shaking. Please don't let me drop this fucking pizza. Run it up, run it up! Congratulations, ladies, well done! Yeah. This is fucking yeah. despicable, man. We won! Bam! In the boys' face. Ladies, give the guys a hand. Let's go! Turn the board, let's go quickly! Thank you, chef. What do you need? What do you need? Get off my station, please. Get off my station, please. It's not about a challenge anymore. Okay. We gotta feed yeah. these people. Yeah, it's yeah, a big yeah. day for them. With some unwelcome assistance from the red team. Real cheese up. Coming up with a pizza chef. Let's go. The blue kitchen has now fed all of its diners. Finally. Thank you. Sorry for the wait. We know men Great food. Thank you, ladies. Uh, gentlemen, at least say thank you to them. Thank you, ladies. Thank you. Thank you. Ladies. Congratulations. Thank you, Slow start, but a very strong finish. As your reward, I'm taking you all on a trip to one of the most picturesque cities in America, San Diego, to visit the most amazing safari. A safari? I'm feeling phenomenal right now. I'm doing more here than I've done in my whole life. I'd like you all to hurry up, because your private jet Oh is God. about to taxi down the runway. Hurry up, let's go. <laughs> Honestly, guys, it was just like a fragmented kitchen with seven of you all doing your own thing. Where is the leader in the blue team? One of you guys had better take over. Taking it over, Chef. I need to see it. Yes, Chef. I think Patrick's way over his head. But if it gets us to win, I don't really care. Let's see what he's got. Listen carefully. I volunteered you all for some very difficult hard labor at one of California's treasures, the Biona wetlands. Got it? Yes, yes chef. chef. Let's go. Hell's Kitchen sucks when you lose. We're in for a shit day. There's no way around it. I just got to find a way to turn this thing around in favor of the blue team. All right, guys, you know what? Let's get positive a little bit, all right? Ladies, welcome. Jump aboard your G4. Oh, this is crazy. Welcome, Kimmy. Yes. Enjoy. We're going up, up, up. Yeah, we're going up in a Jeep Ford. We're ready to rock out with our cocks out. Ladies, congratulations. Thank you. Good job. Here's to the boys. Here's to the boys. <laughs> While the women get used to traveling in style, the men spend the day on the laborious task of beautifying an American treasure. So this is the acacia tree right here that we're going to cut down completely. Holy shit. Big ass thick tree like that with fucking branches sprouting out. We're gonna need Paul Bunyan to chop this thing down. Fucking bucks. Oh my god, look at that rhino! She's like coming in. The safari. And all you see is rhinoceroses and these tall giraffes and baby giraffes. Dude, these giraffes want to, like, make out with us. This is the most action I've gotten in a week. This is nice. He's trying to eat your face. Congratulations. Well done. On our next dinner service, can you promise me one thing? Yes, Chef. Right hand up. I, I, I swear, swear that we will complete service. That we will complete service 
Ladies, good job. I apologize, everyone in front of Chef, for waking you up this morning. You woke them up? Wow. I will not let it happen again. Hell no, I don't believe Barbie's apology. That bitch is fake. I know it wasn't sincere. Can't teach an old dog new tricks. Now, why are we fighting it? It's not that big. Yeah, Break it down, okay. small pieces. Work smart, not hard. We'll start loading these up. Patrick, he's not leading by example. He's leading by saying what to do. Can you just take that one wheelbarrow up to Guy? I don't like it. Everybody together? One, two, three. Boost. Come, Come on. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Come on. Help, 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 help. OK, ready? Yeah. I'm 100% proud of my team today, man. We came together as a unit, and we got the job done. Push. Yeah. Go. Push. But you know, unless we can figure it out in the kitchen, all that shit doesn't really matter. Bravo. No more losing, guys. No more losing. Hell's Kitchen is hours away from opening its doors. We made a promise yesterday, guys. Yeah, yeah we did. We cannot break that. Yeah. Yeah. We all gave Chef Ramsay an oath that we will successfully complete this dinner service tonight. The red team is confident they will keep their promise. Feeling good, feeling great. Over in the blue kitchen, Patrick is determined to lead his team to victory. What's that? What's that? Whoa, 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 what's that? Cauliflower puree? You got to heat that up first before you put it in a squeeze bottle. But not everyone is ready to follow. Everybody's fucking wasting fucking time. Patrick's leading this team, and he's not doing anything to help anybody. Royce, where are we at? We're just getting our equipment. I wouldn't go so high on these. I'm not. I just want him to know that he sucks. We make sure we have nonstick pans, nonstick pans. Got it. Royce needs to calm down on the cockiness. I don't need crap from him. Shut up and do it. Let's do the proteins first. I'm getting all the equipment first. You step off. Shut the fuck up. Right now, I know that I need to step it up, but I don't need one of my teammates telling me what to do, especially Mr. Bandana Patrick. Tonight, the doors of Hell's Kitchen will open for the third time. Dude, we are finishing this fucking service, I swear. Unbelievably, neither team has completed a dinner service. Let's go, let's go. Quick, line up, please. Listen, James is fed up apologizing to patrons. Hey, uh, idiots, I do apologize. I'll see what I can do. So, I decided one person from each team is going to be working as waiters. Uh, ladies. Tiffany, big smile. Yes, chef. Yeah? Uh, blue team. <laughs> Donald. Yes, chef. I need to see each and every one of you focused for the entire service. Yes? Yes, the chef. chef. The key tonight is focus. OK, get on your sections. Let's go, guys. Yes, chef. After two disappointing services from Royce. Uh, Royce, two seconds, please. Chef Ramsay knows just who to call. Ralph, his boss at home. Uh, Ralph, how are you? I'm doing fantastic. I know who he's calling, Ralph Pagano. And I'm like, oh, fuck. I'm like, oh, fuck. Win, lose, or draw. You know, I've got no reservations about how I performed and what I did here. Ralph, just lift it a little bit, will you, please? Come on. Hey, Chef. Roy? Yeah. How you doing? It's fucking brutal, bro. Out of anybody that knows, Chef Ralph knows Hell's Kitchen's no joke. This is your time. This is what it's all about. Yes, Chef. It's time to step up and knock it out. Thank you, Chef. I got to push through, and I got to stay confident. I got to stay focused. Being on the phone with him made me believe that I can win this. Tonight's the night, right? Nice tonight. Yes, yes chef. chef. Uh, James. Yes, Chef. Open Hell's Kitchen, please. Let's go. Yes, Chef. Tonight's dinner service is fully booked with excited diners. I'll have the risotto and the rack of lamb. And American heroes looking forward to an evening of fine dining. Great, gentlemen. Thank you. I'll be right back. And Chef Ramsay is hoping his chefs can finally okay. deliver it. OK, blue team, here we go. Look at me. Focus. Let's go. Flatbread away. Two lots of spaghetti, two risotto. Yes, yes, Chef! I'm ready. I'll take this shit to the next level. I'm coming with my A game, baby. A plus plus. I'm going with the risotto. Go. Right behind you, Chef. Who made the risotto? Me, Chef. Risotto's delicious. Keep it going, Royce. Yes, Chef. I'm back. You got Royce Wagner back. I wish you spoke to Ralph earlier. Fuck me. Guys, keep it going. With Royce delivering on appetizers, the men are off to a smooth start. Keep it going, guys. Don't lose focus. Keep it going. Meanwhile, the women in the red kitchen... I'm dying on a spaghetti and a risotto. ...are off to a bumpy beginning. How long, Dana? Right now, Chef. 
Put it down! Fuck it. It's like soup. Dana, all of you, come here. It's like canned soup. How much sauce you put in there, Dana? Too much, Chef. Just fuck off with you. I mean, it's just like piss. I have another one coming right now, Chef. You know, I fucked up. Any one little thing can set the whole team back, and I don't want to be the person bringing my team down. Dana, yes, get your chef. wits about you. Just wake up a bit. Yes, Chef. Come on, ladies, let's get it together. While Dana's soupy spaghetti spells trouble for the red kitchen. What else is going with that, do you know? Out in the dining room. James, can I have the tickets written properly, please? Yes, Chef. A P P. Don's inability to spell is a little troubling. A P P. E T I Z. With the line. E R S. Not being the best speller in the world, you know, trying to write appetizers. Oh, man. Fucking hard. Oh, fucking hard. Beautiful. That's right, sir. Congratulations. You've just gone past sixth grade. Thick fuck. With Don's tickets finally in. Caesar salad coming in the past. Two Caesar salads. The blue team have put their differences aside and are pushing out the remaining appetizers. Right behind you, chef. Show up peaceful. That's what I like to hear. Good work. Things are going smooth. Things are going out. Things are looking good. And for once, everything's coming together beautiful right now. Service, please. Here you go. Thank you. That's really good. Guys, phenomenal start. Yes? yes Keep chef. it going. Yes, chef. yes, chef. First entree. Two Wellington, one lamb, one card. How long? 20 minutes. 20 minutes? 15 minutes, 15 minutes. What? Hey, come here, you big boy, come here. 10 minutes, 10 minutes, or less. I don't fucking know, give me a second, let me get my fucking head together. How long? Lamb's coming up, everything's coming up now. Where is it? Huh? Coming through, coming through, coming through. Lamb's going past, Lamb is up, chef. Clemenza, come here, you. Yes, chef. Fuck me. They're cooked beautifully. Now that you've raised the bar, you fucking stay there. I Thank swear you, to God, chef. I'll fucking burst you if you drop it. Thank Let's you, go. Chef. Service, please. It's a lamb chop. No big thing. You know, I'm good like that. Throw it at me, I'll fucking take whatever you got coming. Let's go. With Clemenza coming through on the meat station, the men are off to their best start yet. Back in the red kitchen, Dana. How long on the spaghetti? Is trying to redeem herself on appetizers. Lost your spaghetti right behind you. Very nice, that spaghetti. Thank you, Chef. Nice job, Dana. Thank you. What else can I say, dude? I'm the best. On the next table, firefighters do not screw their fucking table, let me tell you. Yes, Chef. Two scallops, one onion, tart, one lobster spaghetti. Yes, yes chef. chef. I'm feeling confident. Hot hand. I'm feeling like Chef is going to say, these scallops are a sexy bitch. I don't know. I'm a sexy bitch. I don't know. Oh, Jesus. Fuck me. Come here. All of you, all of you, come here. Who cooked them? I did, Chef. You did? Yes, Chef. For the firefighters of this country. Fuck. Fucking scallops. Two more, hurry up. While Barbie tries to bounce back on scallops. Drop the scallops. Drop the scallops. In the blue kitchen. Listen up, US Marines, entree. Three cods, three Wellington. Right, yes, Chef. Patrick on fish and Clemenza on meat. I need two and a half minutes. Can you go on that? You get two minutes. Seem to be in sync and are hoping to keep the Blue Kitchen's positive momentum going. We're communicating. The energy level is great, and it's a good sign. I'm going to go to the pass. Fuck me. It's not going to fucking make it, man. I've got three cards in the window. Where's the rest of it? It weren't cooked all the way through, chef. I said I'm going to the pass. Two cards and two Wellington. Why is this so difficult? While Clemenza and Patrick start over on their entrees, the red team is finally ready to go with appetizers for the table of firefighters. All they need are... Scallops, how long? Four minutes. What? Stop. If there's people that aren't pulling their weight on the line, I'm going to take control of their station. I know I'm the leadoff hitter, and if I don't get us on base, you know, we're never going to touch home. You ready? Thanks to Christina. Scallops walking. Finally. Service, please. Appetizers are leaving the red kitchen at a rapid pace. Here is your lobster spaghetti. All good. All good. <laughs> Service, please. Meanwhile, in the blue kitchen. Three cards, three Wellington. How long? How long in a card? Three minutes. How long, Clemenza? Three minutes, not three even mi minutes. Well, if we're at three minutes, why are we slicing already? Just take it off the end chop. You slice it now, it's going to bleed out. 
Let's go, Clemenza. I blew one fucking. I'm gonna be down one fucking Wellington no. now. Yes, I'm gonna be short two Wellington, three Wellington. I'm telling you. How many more you got? I got one, two. That's it. While Clemenza searches for Wellingtons. Fuck. Back in the red kitchen. First on tray, firefighters. One card, two Wellington, one New York strip. Yes, yes chef. chef. Kitty on meat. Four minutes. Four minutes. I can walk. And Brianna on fish are ready to impress Chef Ramsay with their first set of entrees. How long? Two card. Four minutes. This is my chance to show Chef that I can be a leader and I'm on point. I'm ready to step it up. I'm about to walk, Bri. Fuck. What's up? Did you burn it? Yes. Fuck me, dude. My strips that came out were perfect. My Wellingtons were good. The fish is a coach right. I gotta refire that shit again. Oh. Kimmy, she just burned it again. We're gonna need more time. Ugh. Oh my. Fucking God, Brianna, just cook the fish right. Coming up in five seconds. Walking down, walking going down, in. walking down. God. Right here. I've got half a portion of fucking cod. Where's the other half cod? Yeah. Stop. All of you. That's barely a portion. And where's that going? Fuck. Oh, I didn't realize they shrank down that much, Chef. It's a bit like your brain. Not only is it shrunk, but it's disappeared. Can I have two New York strip and two full portions of cod? Yes, yes, sir. yes, While Brianna and Kimmy start over on their entrees. Kimmy, I'm so sorry. Back in the blue kitchen. Fuck, overcooked. Clemenza has just realized he has a big problem on his hands. I don't have any more. US Marines, how long? I'm in trouble. This is not good. Chef, I don't have any more. Say that again. Chef, I don't have any more. Hey, fucking baby rhino screwed the Marines. It's pathetic. It's the US Marines. Hey, let's go, you. You're fucking mess. You get yourself out of it. I know it's going to look embarrassing, but fucking take him to the Marines. Yes, Chef. Guys, unfortunately, tonight we are red short at Wellington. Can we recommend the New York strip steak to you guys? six Marines with that hardcore fucking eyeball look staring at me. And I'm like, holy shit. Thank you. Thank yeah. you very much. Appreciate it. Thank you, guys. I'm totally relieved. It's probably the biggest relief of pressure I've had in my life. We can sub the New York Strip. Next is three New York Strip, three cards. Yes, Chef. I'll make it happen, Chef. Let's go. While the men get started on a new order for the table of Marines, Back in the red kitchen, Brianna. I'm walking with the cod. And Kimmy are finally ready with their entrees for the table of firefighters. Good fucking hell, finally. All they need is. Garnish. Yes, yes sir. sir. Garnish is not a hard station, but I feel a pressure that I have to make sure it's perfect. Hot pan, chef. I don't want to be on that chopping block ever again. Where's the dumplings? Where's the dumplings? Coming, chef. Coming. I'm sorry, chef. They're not ready yet. No, uh, chef. Because you forgot. Yes, chef. Pathetic. Roche, where are the dumplings? I forgot. Really? Really? Can I get two full portions of cod with the garnish? Yes, yes chef. chef. While the red team waits on Roshni, back in the blue kitchen. Three cod, three New York strip. US Marines, how long? Clemenza and Patrick. I'm ready to go. Coming through, coming through, coming through, coming through. Have finally completed the order for the blue team's table of American heroes. Behind your chef with the cot. Sorry, chef, last steak is up. Service, please. <laughs> how is everything? New York strip is real good. Just with the week. Let's go, let's keep on going. Whatever needs to be done, don't stop. With the men now back on track. Hi. Entrees continue to make their way out to the dining room. Service, please. Meanwhile, in the red kitchen. Hey, are you ready now with your garnish? Yes, chef. Let's go. Brianna, Roshni, and Kimmy are hoping that their third attempt at the firefighter's entrees will prove to be the charm. Look at your face. Why are you so distraught? It's fucking here. Fuck me. Dumplings, raw. Hey, come here, all of you. Here's the big insult. Just touch that. Stone cold. Pass it on, touch it. They're cold. Stone cold. Touch these. Touch these! Oh, Roshni. Dumplings? Come on, that's the easiest part of the dish. You can't even poach a dumpling. I'm sorry, chef. Brutal! Every chef has a bad day, but I'm not letting it get the best of me. I'm ready to fight back, and I'm going to fight back. Give me, I can walk. 
Yeah, walk, walk. This no. is the card. Excellent. You guys communicating well. Good job. Oh, Jesus. Burn underneath. I got raw meat here. Yeah? Who cooked the Wellington? I did, Chef. Kimmy! I got one sort of rare and one sort of looking weird. Look at that. Fuck me, dude. But here's the big insult. Boiled one side and black the next. In over two hours, it's been a nightmare. Pathetic. Chef's definitely about to explode. You'll never, ever get entrees out like this. Ever. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight of you. Fuck off out of here. Get out. Out. And one more thing. Get out. After a miserable evening of repeated failures on entrees, <laughs> Chef Ramsay has had enough. I cannot believe we fucked that up yet again. My pride's gone, my dignity's gone. Done. How long is it going to take me to fucking rebuild that? While the women are left to contemplate their failure, come on, last table, let's go. The men are poised to achieve a convincing victory. We got this, guys. Keep going. Hold on. Ten seconds on that last steak, chef. Quickly. Sorry, chef's last steak is up. Service, please. <laughs> I like it. That's right, baby. Good work. Another very difficult. Painful evening. But in a sea of shit, there were a couple of highlights bobbing up and down. Royce, welcome back. Thank you, Chef. Christina, you finally found your voice. Yes, Chef. Unfortunately, your team didn't gel. The losing team tonight, obviously, is the women. You went so far backwards, you couldn't even get any entrees out. Ladies, Get upstairs and start thinking of which two should be up for elimination. I can name six straight off. Piss off. Chef. As a team, we absolutely let them down. We cook like a bunch of assholes. We'll be lucky if it's only one person going home tonight. Let's make this short and sweet. Who's going up? I'm going up. I'm absolutely not giving up. I know that I'm a strong chef, and I think that my going home would hurt the team. Just pray that Chef Ramsay believes me. Does everyone agree that they, their one vote is for Barbie? Uh, sorry, for Brianna. Yes. Yes. OK, done. Who's the other vote for? Oh, well, Scott, most yelled at. We're all worried. We know that one of us is going home, and it's upsetting. Thank God. Nobody is really voting for me. So I'm going to say Barbie because, I mean, like, I feel like you were very quiet. I'm voting for Barbie because Barbie, like, fucked me. What are you talking about? We all had a sucky night. But somehow, I'm a scapegoat again. I'm not willing to accept this. I would have to vote for Dana. Yeah, yeah, Dana got crushed off the bat. Fuck off, Barbie. I hope you get sent home tonight. Barbie can't do anything right. I mean, she sent up scallops. They were raw. Every night in service, she has made critical mistakes. So I'm going to keep voting for Barbie as long as she keeps messing up. What are you going to do? I don't know. Robin. Yes, chef. First nominee and why? Our first nominee is Brianna, because of the cod. It's what held us back. Second nominee and why? Barbie. When Barbie touched the scallops, she failed. They were raw. OK. Barbie, Brianna, step forward. Let's go. I suppose these choices are as good as any, but let's be honest. There's one more that deserves to be in the middle, right there. Roshni, get your ass over here. You, madam, were shocking tonight. I mean, really shocking. You're in way over your head, aren't you? No, chef. I cook with my heart. It's what I do. It's what I love doing. Today, yes, 
I did screw up, I fessed up to it. But I'm here, chef, and I want you to see what I have. Brianna, why do you think you should stay in Hell's Kitchen? Truthfully. Truthfully, I'm a team player. I know I'm a good cook. I know I can be here till the end. I screwed up the cod, but I'll learn from that mistake. You disappeared. I know I have fight in me, and I know I can do this. Yeah. Bravo. Barbie, you're like the appendix in your brigade that they all want out. You know, I've made some mistakes with my team chef, and everything that they've asked me to do, I've come across and tried to do. And I messed up on the scallops. I own it, but I was talking, and I was helping, and I tried to work hard for my team. <sighs> I am a fighter, and I'm not going to stop. Tough one tonight. Really tough. My decision is... Brianna. Give me a jacket, please. Time to leave Hell's Kitchen. Damn. You're not getting stronger, and I need someone strong. Very strong. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Good night. I came here to Hell's Kitchen to challenge myself. I don't think Chef Ramsey really got to see what kind of chef I am. I'm a very passionate chef, but he didn't think that I was uh, enough of a fighter about it, and he's probably right. Both of you back in line. Listen carefully, all of you. I'm looking for someone to emerge and to become a unique leader. Right now, there's more than just one of you that are disappearing. In the next challenge, you'll be tested unlike ever before. Now, get some sleep, because you're going to need it. Piss off. Barbie's still here. It's so annoying. The last thing I look at before I go to bed at night is fucking Barbie. I don't want to see that. I'll be happy when that bed is empty. Dana definitely wants to get rid of me because she's for surely intimidated by me. But I'm not going anywhere until Chef Ramsay tells me it's my time to go. Period. Blue team's back, baby. Coming out like motherfucking Pacquiao. Red team got that ass tapped tonight. Red team's going to go down tomorrow, too. Tonight, Brianna had a battle with the cod, and the cod won. And that's why her time in Hell's Kitchen was a short one.